hey beautiful people welcome or welcome back again to another juicy video my name is Dale goodness and i am your captain today we're gonna be doing something i probably haven't done before it's gonna be like what's in my work bag i recently got this bag from youtube health um most of you knew about the program i went for i got invited by youtube to london um for an event so this was one of the souvenirs they gave to us so i'm transferring my work things to this new bag so i can be taking this bag to work so i, I thought like mm, let me just film a video on what i take to work and what's in my work bag so let's get right into the video first thing first we are going to be unboxing one of my like favorite crop brand that is fix if you know me very well you know i'm a fix girl yes i love fix i wear fix i only stopped wearing fix because i'm now in the theater i need to wear the hospital scrub and all that but when i was in the world i'm a fix person anytime i go for agency shifts also i'm a fix person i wear fix all the time so let's open it okay so fix this packaging is different from the one i normally get and this oh guys this is so beautiful look no stale it is over for all of you oh my god look at this packaging i'm not gonna bore you to read this note oh boy says thank you for choosing fix you're welcome fix i love your brand i wear your brand all the time let me just open this thing Ooh. i'm gonna tell you why i choose this color that is because this color is almost like my scrub color but it's not the same color it's gonna be fine this is like a scrub jacket in the theater is very cold okay wow guys look at the inside it's gonna be so warm oh god and this is in all size it's gonna help with the cold in the theater i don't know if you can see but i have my name on nostale oh yeah i love it i love it but what's in my work bag proper proper i had most of the things i'll be speaking about in this video would be in my amazon store so please kindly check out my amazon store to order for yours as well okay okay right so i've got this bag so it is like a waste bag I got it in purple color to match my crocs yeah so this will go over my waist so this will go over my waist like this and then i just have to put in some things which i am going to be showing you now so this is how it will be at work with my scrub saying us the scrub is saying us there slay oh it's very hard now and you would be wondering what do i use this bag for i'm going to be showing you because it's got loads of zips so this is where i'm going to be keeping our control draw key every theater has a medication cupboard there's a bundle of keys and sometimes when i put it in my pocket it's just too heavy so i'm going to put it here where it's safe for just my reach okay we all know the legal implications if anything goes wrong with control drugs and you don't want to lose the key or you don't want anything to go missing when you are the one in charge of the theater okay the side pockets are going to be for pen you know how it feels when you bend down when you have pens in your pocket and you bend down and all your pens are on the floor with this bag kiss that goodbye okay for my pen here i'm going to be putting it in the bag so you can see so i know you say black 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 but in the uk we use black pen more often in the theater we use red as well for control drugs see how the pens all fit so this it doesn't fall off this thing i'm going to be putting in this bag is my scissor scissor will match with my scrub so you see so i know you might be wondering what would i be doing with a scissor so we have a lot of things we cut and in emergency you don't want to be looking for scissor you want to have it handy for you to just cut 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 and reach my scissors anytime 
this breast wash i don't really use this much often in the theater because we have a wall clock but i used to use this when i was in the world so i'll still keep it because if i go for agency shifts i might need it so i'll just pin it somewhere here yeah pin it here it's all coming together another thing i have in my work bag is my pen light so with this i don't use it in the theater that often as well but in the world we use it for neuro assessments i also have my id cards here and then you notice i have got a tape here as well so this this tape is always handy because you don't want to be looking for tape when you need one as a nurse either maybe a patient is bleeding and you need to secure a dressing or the theater sometimes the lines are all over the place i just use the tape to keep it a little bit tidy so usually we'll put it on top of my scrub anyway but for the purpose of this video i'm just gonna put it here okay a very important thing i have in my work bag is um hand cream so i use this cetra ben um just to um keep my hand moisturized you can get any hand cream not necessarily the one i use you can get any hand cream that just makes your hand soft because um most of the times we wash our hand very frequently or the gloves tends to dry our hands so i always have hand cream handy uh, most hospitals have hand creams all around but i usually carry mine just this will go inside the big zip the hand cream because it's heavy of course i would i'm gonna put it inside yeah then another thing i have is um sanitary pads i'm not, I'm not gonna show you that because it's nasty but sanitary pad is inside now um, I like to keep it in the bag just in case I go to urinate and then I just need to wear it urgently instead of me to go back to my big bag and get it. I already have it in my waist bag. Very important thing I always have in my bag is my Victoria's Secret fragrance mist. Love addict. So I love how it makes me smell nice and it's not that expensive. Oh god, I love it so much. I love it link in my Amazon store you can get it as well so yeah this is something i use often i usually keep it here anyways just in case i go to the toilet and then sometimes when you come up on the toilet even if you didn't like have a pool it just the smell of toilet follows you so i just quickly spray it around so i always keep it in my small wig bag and then obviously my car keys um go in here chewing gum chewing gum because um most of the times i carry food to work and they are very spicy like with oil and all that so i finish eating rinse my mouth and just put a bubble gum that has a mint smell so that i don't have my mouth smelling fishy fishy meaty meaty what else do i want to say oily oily <laughs> last thing i want to do is to have not so good mouth odor not like it's halitosis but just smelling on fresh so i always have this with me scrub cap um i don't use this more often but just in case the case will not be stressful case i use this at work but my ears hurt like because of the mask we wear the mask here so it hurts a lot so sometimes if i don't want to wear the hospital scrub cap which is the one i wear often because i can literally throw that one away and it's more good for infection control but this is reusable so i have to wash it myself because it's personal anyways so this has a button here and then it helps get my face mask so the face mask is not just sitting on my ears it's on this part to relieve the pressure there because over time it gets to um cause my ears to get red and get so painful so i wear this sometime to prevent that pain okay so i just put put it here. i'm looking so colorful can your nose ever eh if you see me in the theater like this would you, would you not say ah i don't think i want to be i don't think i want to be operated on i'm okay i'm all right hey not there also in my world bag is my water bottle okay so this also was given to me by youtube health thing if i want to make tea a coffee and put in this bottle to keep it warm all through the day and drink at work because with anesthetics you need to be awake all the time sometimes it can be boring when you're not doing anything so coffee does help me stay awake so this water bottle so with this i love it so much because it has time on it so it has time to tell me when to drink and how i haven't drank enough in the day i'll be honest i don't always follow the time here and how much to drink I drink sometimes i drink over it sometimes i don't drink enough 
um, I'm not gonna lie that I follow it strictly but it does help to know that oh in the morning drink all this in the afternoon drink all this and then refill again another thing that's always in my work bag is umbrella yeah who carries umbrella I do if you know the UK weather very well you know that the UK weather is bipolar and it could rain it could snow it could shine anything in a day so no matter how the weather forecast is i always carry umbrella um the distance between where i park my car and go to work is a little bit so i need to get this in case it's raining heavily and i still have to go to work always have this handy if i need it i don't always need it to be honest because sometimes i just run as well but i have it just in case i need to cover my hair especially if on a bad day I also have my lunch pack that I yes guys this is what i take to work and this is what is in my work bag let me know in the comment section do you think i missed anything or uh, do you take any of these things to work if you're a nurse and there's something you think i should add to my what to bring to work bag let me know in the comment section oh if i'm at home this stays inside the big bag okay so that when i'm just going to work i just pick this and when i get to work i take this out just put it on my waist but guys that is what is in my work bag and yeah this is it i just hang it like a school girl and off i go i hope you love my video enough to subscribe to my channel and i hope you love my video enough to hit the like button let me know in the comment section i hope i'm not missing anything anyways but if you think i'm missing anything let me know i'll see you guys later bye